ancestry put fire in my soul put fire in my soul I lived in Wisconsin till I was 14 where wide open spaces were all that I'd seen they beckoned to me they beckoned to me flat 
space, the river of my thoughts sweeps against a steel and neutral sky. I dream in pirouetting, shadow silhouetting, sunsets keep repeating. Feel the sky, feel the sky, feel the sky. Virginia. In Chatham was the school where I was taught. My mother dreamed in pictures of her family, and I devoured the art books that she bought. The river of my life began to curl and swirl. I learned to look to see the petals of a flower unfurl. How could I paint a bunch of flowers and still see traces of the dusk on every petal or burnished copper glinting from a scratch upon the metal I painted the lilacs I painted the corn the colors would sing to me Big bunches of lilies and dainty lace flowers In a rose every petal I'd see Purples and yellows, reds and greens Sky and space and air Large as the soul and high as the moon and so fair My brush bathed in paint and my canvas was drenched with its thorough Never quenched was my thirst, for I must paint. I must paint. I must paint. Paints and I are on the way. It's 1904, and I can say I'm ready for the 20th century. Chicago was busy, Chicago was bold. It made me feel dizzy, it made me feel old. No young. And today I can view it in a different way. 
if you ask me about Chicago, I'd say I love Chicago Lakes and theaters and Sullivan's architecture I love Chicago Trains racing through the city Jazz at the pier Meet me in Chicago next year I love Chicago, looking like Shore Drive. But the lyric Samson and Delilah drinks at the Drake at five. Windy City, blue Chicago, hub of those boats of the air. Snowtime or summertime, springtime or fall. I love Chicago, that's all, that's all. I love Chicago, that's all. Chicago has its bright and golden face, but I was lost and looking for my place. Just like a tumbling bird scrambling to shore. I found the city bleak and cold and more. It was ugly, so very ugly, gray and old. I had a rude awakening when I was 17. The rooms at the Art Institute were drably olive green. And into that drab green walked a completely naked man. I wish to love Chicago, but that wasn't in my plan. Nude, rude, mute, and mute with what? I never want to paint nude men. Nude men. I never want to paint nude men. I left Chicago. I see myself as in a mirror somewhere quite apart. I nearly died from typhoid fever, then made a fresh start in New York. It was September. is a time to sing of pear trees and pumpkins and kids and swings when central parks decked out in great golds and greens the fawn in new york dreams its dreams the cats trim their whiskers the dogs try to mind the wind lifts the mist skirts high in the sky the sun dreams of winter and naps in the dawn New York knows that summer is gone. The cats trim their whiskers, the dogs try to mind. The wind lifts the mist skirts high in the sky. The sun dreams of winter and naps in the dawn. New York knows that summer is gone. in love with copper pots and pans and hammered brass when William Chase enrolled me in his still life class. I painted a dead rabbit in a handsome copper pot and wondered at the newborn life from flesh and metals wrought. From sweating welders' hands and labor bending to a task, how could such art be made from screaming industry, I'd ask. And asking I became my river swimming in the gorge feeling synergy empowered by flowers and the forge industry and animals and smoke and fire and flowers my rabbit won a scholarship and took me to lake george when i came back to new york town i walked into the spring and in the beauty of New York my soul began to sing
The flowering paired on the streets of the city. It's springtime in New York. A song's in the air, even Wall Street is pretty when springtime fills New York. Miss Liberty smiles on Staten, and Gandhi walks Union Square. My heart wants to burst on Houston and First, for springtime is everywhere. Taxis blaring, temples flaring, blossoms explode on the trees. Even the metro's impossibly retro, yet everyone still agrees. When springtime fears New York, the world all stops and smiles. The birds and the breeze play tag in the trees on Brooklyn's enchanted miles. Fifth Avenue's in bloom. The sun's in every room. And scraping the sky, the buildings fly high. They're dreaming of old New York. Cause it's springtime. Wandering. Rodin scribbles I didn't like then, more nude men. But you could hardly tell that they were anything at all. How could this strange and modern art have power to enthrall? Later I would paint the body in one line. Like Matisse and like Rodin, and folks would say, how fine. But there were things like clouds in sky and flowers that I saw, so different from the images and scenes so crass and raw, where art was trying desperately to see itself on you. I found it all at 291 Fifth Avenue. The walls exploding with art, the world was full of art. A hundred million thoughts and dreams, a hundred new ideas, it seems, where there's no room for me, where it's too big for me. I left New York. to Chicago to earn money, making lace for advertisements. I got measles, my eyes grew weak. My mother got tuberculosis. I studied with Alan Maymont at Virginia University. I painted abstract painted colors, wondering if I would ever be an artist. My canvas is blank, but it winks at me Like the sun behind the apple tree I'm hiding my pleasure, I really can sing But I'm teasing your brain and I'll drive you insane Like a bird in the rain That just needs the wind to roll and left me suitcase and all in Amarillo. I taught at school and wondered, how can one teach art in Amarillo? 
or anywhere. It's in the air, it's in the soul. It can't be taught, you just must know. But Texas love me caught my heart's distress. Hugged me with its winds and dusted me with terror and emptiness. And in the terror I found my soul, I found my country vast and wide in endless night. I stood in sand and viewed the desert like an ocean flowing all around me. And pouring grief and joy into my heart, my land became my heart. The river of my soul, a pouring, roaring, soaring to a fork, where storm and sand and tide and land would fill my heart and take Sweep me once again into New York. Behind my dreams for four long years Until they wrapped me up and made me fly I thought that I had buried all the wishes and the tears Had said a requiem that let them die And then I took a stump of charcoal Full of all my fears And let it draw the rhythm of the sky I turned and faced eternity And walked into the light And drew the silent music Of the night Exploded, and it pole it's a showed by drawings. Private thoughts kept inside, private thoughts meant to hide, private dreams sheltered from the sun. To Alfred Stieglitz at 291. And that same year my mother died. So timidly I came. Outside and lie 
take a seed from mother's soul. I bowing at a death began to grow. 291 Fifth Avenue, Stieglitz Garden of Art. Paintings in myriads of magic. That's where I got my first start in New York, where they said that my paintbrush had captured West Texas. It's hard to envision I'm part of the vision of 291 Fifth Avenue, Stieglitz Garden of Art. Paintings in myriads of magic. That's where I got my first start. Where I knew I was part of the scene. I was part of the art of New York. I wish to be shy. Let the world pass me by. I never had sought or wanted fame, but now. To set the whole wide world on fire. Today, all New York knows my name. 291 Fifth Avenue, Stieglitz Garden of Art. Paintings in myriads of magic. That's where I got my first start in New York, where they said that my paintbrush had captured West Texas. Just a suspicion. I'm part of the vision of 291 Fifth Avenue, Stieglitz Garden of Art. Paintings in myriads of magic. That's where I got my first start. Where I knew I was part of the scene. I was part of the art of New York. New York. New York.
cupped to catch the morning silence or stretched to close my lips and stop my sighs. A thousand rainbows wash the dawn's horizon. A thousand smiles inside the morning mist. A thousand miles and moments rest between us. Tomorrow and the time that we first kissed. You are a dream, a reverie, a candle shrouded in the smoke of magic mystery. You see my soul, you would console my heart and serenade my dreams in silver melody. You are my hope, you are my friend, you touch my gentleness and wish to share the world with me. Try to tame my dreams. Nothing is just what it seems. I would seek a gentle word to guide my way. Alfred meant so much to me. He would help me learn to see. Though we looked out at different worlds within each passing day. Mirth, Alfred said, Don't. But all of his questions made me think and learn. We needed each other, passionately searching to discern. I hate poetry and speech of nothing. How can a poem capture what is real and nothing come to ever anything more than nothing? Alfred writes poems in photographs, but they are real. I understand them. Once he saw a screen with hands, he kissed my fingers and captured my hands with his camera. My hands were caught to become a
There is a world beyond my understanding, a world of seashells, rocks, and sand, and tiny things, a world of stars, and skulls, and bones, so infinitely clean. There is a wide Nothing is less real than realism. Details are confusing. I must eliminate them to find meaning. Dry and windy plains and desert sand Vegetation striving, struggling for a promised land Bones of the death once hung in life Now resting white and unperturbed Upon eternity's plateau Still waiting clean and undisturbed Santa Fe and far beyond I sought my dancing muse And land it told me take my heart Where it could not refuse The shells and bones I brought to Alfred Bleached and beautiful Shadows and even light Softness on a skull But he saw death where I saw life And turned away instead And took another lover maybe One day he was 
was dead While he was ill I nursed him Through those many months of pain And when the sun released his soul I found him once again The world would know my Alfred His air, his strength, his grace And I would turn away again And seek a different space
becomes blue as blue becomes the sky. Blue is blue and blue is RBQ. Blue is the silence, blue with the air. Blue is a pansy in blue. Cross against blueness, stucco cuts blue. Legs are eggs of blue. Is blue and you is blue and blue is a big you. Blah! 
blackbirds bear witness to the day and sing and sing. I lie upon my back under the clouds and close my eyes and float among the clouds. My song becomes the colors of yellow, green, and gold, and mingles with the painting of my soul. Magic clouds embrace the sun, magic clouds in the blue, magic clouds caress the to you. Magic clouds embrace the sun. Magic clouds in the blue. Magic clouds caress the one who has carried the sunbeams to you. my 
my friend the librarian, a great red puppy to give trouble to the day. My friend the librarian asked me I have that puppy to keep forever. I like it. I snorted, so I'm told, and I shook my head in puzzlement. Don't you wonder how that puppy, married to its canvas, may be bartered for a million dollars? While its inspiration sweet and tender, bright and real, nodding on its stock is plucked at will. My flowers are my song, my music caught in crevices and skulls and mountains draped in flowing garments and clouds. I painted a colossal canvas of sky above the clouds that vision hangs in Chicago, my nemesis. Shrouds of softness, dreaming colors, made of light. In nineteen seventy four, I lost the light, I lost my sight, and walked into the night. I became blind, I learned to see the things I missed before. The length of a sigh, the depth of a kiss, the sound of a singing shawl. My eyes became windows to all of my dreams, my dreams looked out on light, and love became my guiding hand, and music was my sight. When I became blind, I learned to see all things the world might hide. A cricket's pose, a baby's thought, the wind, the witches ride. My eyes looked deeply on my soul, my soul began to sing. I saw the heavens wildly dance. Bells like flowers <laughs> My brushes become dry my canvases remain white and life slips away like sound slowly into the night of the
Oh 
all I'm tired of searching for the dawn I'm on my way so wait a moment the stars will Silver through the trees I see your face is smiling I feel you in the breeze I'm coming home I hear your whisper I see the candles burning light Your arms are And I 
I smell the sage. I am embraced by all that I believe and cannot save that. A promise that the world will shine with the candles when the sun is gone, and I am blind and see the evening star. dream a life and all I love and cannot see become the dreams inside of me and I become the river of my dreams I become the river of my dreams Oh! <laughs>